Hi there, my name is Richard Kletnix. I'm the chef at A Culinary Conspiracy, and I'm going to show you how to do a nice sabayon sauce for the Omnivore's Ottawa blog. And a sabayon sauce is basically just a fancy term for a, a nice creamy sauce, and we're going to be making it with uh, lavender infused Prosecco today, and it goes great with fresh seasonal ber berries, which are available right now um, in Ottawa. And we're going to be using, actually, berries that I picked myself at uh, the Orleans Fresh Fruit Farm. Okay, so here we go. This is how you do the sabayon sauce. Um, what we have here is six egg yolks, one cup of Prosecco, which has been infused with lavender overnight in the fridge. We've removed the lavender, and what we have here is a third of a cup of sugar. And the Prosecco is just basically a sparkling white wine. Yeah, and so we're, all we need to do is take a large stainless steel bowl, and the reason we use a large bowl is because um, when we whip these over a bain-marie, the volume is going to increase two or threefold, and so we need the space for it. So there we go, we'll head over to the uh, Bain Marie and start whisking away. So a Bain Marie basically is just, we have here a pot of uh, simmering water and uh, we're gonna use it to basically cook these egg yolks. And uh, the key here is not to let the bottom of the bowl actually touch the water because you'll end up with scrambled eggs. And so we'll just place it over top and start whisking. This should take about four or five minutes to cook. And what we're looking for is uh, a very thick sauce, a nice, light, and airy. And uh, when you'll see at the end, when we lift our whisk from the bowl, it'll form a ribbon down from the whisk. And this will just go beautifully with those little berries. So here we go, the sabayon is just about done. And uh, you can see the volume has easily tripled. And uh, it's become nice and light. And we're almost there. We're just looking for a ribbon to fall from the whisk when we lift it out of the bowl. Never stop whisking. No, never stop whisking because it'll scramble your egg yolks. And uh, it wouldn't give you a very nice texture at all in this sabayon. Can you save it if you accidentally scramble it? Um, you could probably strain them out as long as it's not too bad. If you just overheat it a little bit, I would use a sieve and uh, strain it out and you should be fine. So there we go. You can see it's nice and thick. And, and it should also go. be light. Yes, very light. Yeah. And the Prosecco, you can smell it, it's beautiful. So we're ready to assemble here. All we're going to do is take our nice macerated berries and place these in uh, the bottom of a martini glass. Now macerated berries means they've been sitting overnight in the white wine. That's correct, and some sugar. And some sugar. And it just helps bring the juices out of the berries. So that's perfect like that. And what we'll do is take a ladle and just ladle some of this beautiful sabayon right over the top. Nice and light. Just like that. I've got some lavender from my garden here. Just adds a nice little touch. And uh, then our espresso shortbreads. And there and you have it. That's it. Let me just... Well, thank you very much, Chef for Thank being you. on Omnivores Ottawa. It's been a pleasure.